yeah, welcome back to the channel. I'm uh, back on the side of the Land Cruiser. Let's see here if I get some. I have to start uh, changing wheel bearing on the right hand side and this uh, is said up here was a little loose so then I should maybe change the whole arm they say and well, that's maybe true but I have been busy so I haven't been able to do something but I'm trying to start something today or this evening just because because when you're supposed to take off things like this, you have to try to oil in screws or things. This one will have to go on. Something up there. I don't remember quite what I was up with when I was taking out all the parts. I think it was the screws under here. In worst case, now I have to be able to get into using the bolt in here I'm using a carpenter tool. A screwdriver and I put in some oil. Now it's time to. Yeah. I'm just trying again. I'll just open this locking. Splint. take off the big sucker this is 35 millimeters it's not ordinary size at all and it's put on very hard yeah I had to buy, buy a big breaker bar just to get this shit loose and different things to get over to the beach. Now my big problem is to get this shit to hang somewhere. Now it's very interesting to see if it's like I believe it should be or not. Because here is four screws. There, there, there and under. just have to leave that for tomorrow and uh, leave it with oil and see if I have some even stronger tools at work so I can get off those four screws so I can get off the wheel bearing so you have to see
yeah it's a new day I have to try to get those uh, screws out from the wheel bearing system I have bought a new rust loosening system that is supposed to work a little different Lost. Yeah. So you see, are you seeing one ends of the Yep. Losing up. Go loose. Very nice. You see, one screw on top there, one screw down here, and one screw here. And now all of them is loose. What more do I need to do now? Yes, I need to take off this ABS sensor. Standing in the back here, I have to find out which type that is. So six angles. Yeah, then I'm out here after being in order new parts. Trying to get out the speed sensor, it just broke in two. So I had to go and order a new one. That's going to take some days. I start to be tired of this. So much thing I've been doing with this car, and still it's making problems. But I just have to keep on on how to try to loosen the wheel bearing here. That is uh, locked up so badly. So I have to try the good old fashioned heat it with something hard and see if that helps.
Yeah, now I just have to keep on putting on oil and hope this shit is loosening up. This was just making problems. Yeah, one more day are gone. I'm just having problems with everything. It's okay, the weather has been warm. But they haven't dried up as I'm hoping because maybe the tent is keeping it from drying up. But The big serious problem here is I have been able to get the screws up on this wheel bearing and everything but the wheel bearing is completely locked in it's don't want to come out at all so if I not able to move it tomorrow after you used a lot of oil I just have to take out everything here from up here down under steering arm stabilization arm yeah, then I have to take out everything and try to get help somewhere to force that shit out of uh, the place or just buy a new part just, uh, it's completely stuck it's completely hopeless I can't move it I've been beating it I've been using uh, special rust removing oils the whole day no well, this is kind of hell on wheel rust 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 just making problem now I've taken off the covers in here also because I have to change this arm too see if I first have to take down all this shit to be able to get it out tomorrow yeah then I can just start and see if I can open the screws further up the screws here I get up very easy no problem but the rest and also the sensor, speed sensor, ABS sensor and as I have started looking at the other wheel bearing it looks like I didn't need to move that one but I tried and it get broken so that shit I also had to go and order a new one so for this evening I'm quite uh, pissed off on this car I just want to go in and relax I have to see tomorrow what I'm doing because this is this is one of the things that take too much time for two simple things and you see all the videos about changing this is just turn up the screws just wiggle it a little and I take it off this one it's not big at all I used hours just to try to open it a little around here everything is rusted together completely rusted together it's just completely garbage and this is because in Norway we sold the roads like we are crazy we ruined the cars completely so but hopefully one of the days here is going to be a better day again because now I'm getting off for today so please come back please uh, give me some uh, good advice and some uh, I need to get some courage back because now I'm really tired. So, thank you. Please put a like, please subscribe, please put a comment.